Good morning. It's uh, Monday, 3rd of August, 2015. I was just doing another load of uh, dishes while I was making my coffee. It's probably cold again since it took longer to wash dishes than to heat the coffee. I'm making some progress here. A lot of progress. I'll uh, finish out this thing before I leave to visit my mom. Uh, I'm not having a lot of time to clean this house, uh, visiting it all the time. I'm really, really beat, tired from all these crazy hours. But, uh, I've got to get this done somehow. Okay, this is the mess that I've got to deal with in this living room. i got to clear this whole living room out. There's really not enough room in this house. So, hopefully by the time before my mom gets out, you hear the word out, don't you, Joe? Okay, I go crazy. I guess I gotta deal with him. Yeah, I gotta deal with you. Anyway, um, that's the project. Well, it's a pretty nice day. I'm surprised the garbage men haven't come yet. It's about 10.30 in the morning. God, I slept heavy. <laughs> there was like a couple days I only got like two hours sleep. Turned out my mom had been uh, dehydrated. That was what was going wrong with her. I don't know how you can get dehydrated in a hospital. But they fix it now. I hope she hasn't um, gotten any damage from it. They were saying the other day that her heart was doing triple beats. Intermittently, I pull him off. He always chases these cars. The trash guy came. It's not the recycle. Maybe it's not recycle day. Well, there's somebody's dog or is loose. Huh? I think he lives there. They just let him out in the yard. Well, it looks like they picked everybody's recycle up but ours. This is a recycle container. No, they didn't pick this one up either. It's so full of stuff. Uh, maybe they're just running late. Well, this morning I'll take another trip out and keep my mom from getting lonely. That is a lonely place in this big giant room all by herself. Before I go, I'm going to do some cleaning in the living room. i got to start making some progress on that. Get the bed down there. I'm converting the living room into a bedroom for her so that she can recover further. Her uh, knees are still screwed up even after this, so it's going to be... She's still got a tough time walking. She needs a knee replacement. Well, I guess the little dogger's minor hunger strike is over. He's pooing more again. So, he hadn't been eating as much. He's depressed because my mom's gone. He's like really dotes on her. <coughs> but he's back to normal now. As far as that. Uh, it's really a nice day. Well, this area of the counter is almost clear. I just filled the sink back up, of course. Uh, okay, I'll leave that and I'll clean that before I leave. Oh, this is terrible. <laughs> this is such a mess. Okay. So pull this all out and clean it. Get this uh, get this area the way it's supposed to be. Yeah, I guess what I want to do is clear this area and use this uh, put this flat pan there. 
we're going to be really needing that soon with the way the stove is. Uh, I'll clear this area and put that uh, black coffee maker, coffee slash espresso maker there. And uh, I'll put the can opener back where it was, I guess. Then all I got to do is, um, I guess I'll pull that towel rack out of there and I'll put the toaster over where it was too. And then I'll put this big grill thing over where, over here. This area can get cleared out a little bit. I can pull my shredder out and stuff like that. It doesn't really belong there. I just have it there temporarily to keep people from throwing junk there. This could be nice, really. That's got a stavey and a beverage and beverage and coffee area. I don't know what all that other crap is everybody threw there. I might have thrown it there, cleaning other stuff out of the way. I don't know. Okay, I got my mom's little uh, toy box thing over there. It's full of paperwork. That's a problem. There's just so much stuff here and it's randomly packed. Those on the corner there, it's all empty boxes. I'm not really too worried about that. I should you get the cat to stop scratching it up. That's empty boxes in the corner there too. They aren't going to be empty for long. Uh, this stuff I don't know. I gotta, I gotta start packing boxes uh, unrandomly. And she's already told me, you know, she doesn't want me just packing them. So <laughs> she wants, she says she knows where everything is. But it's gotta be done. I can't even fit the bed in here. So it's gotta be done. I'm gonna pull that table out. That's gonna stay in here for a side thing for a bed. I gotta buy another extension cord. I got my hundred foot cord I'm using right now. Run the electric out here because this breaker kept tripping on our circuit. I think I don't know if uh, somebody's hooked in to us and we're running two houses. Somebody's illegally hooked in, or uh, or if uh, something's wrong with the electric, either way, I shouldn't run the uh, circuit if it's tripping all the time. So I'm running cords. Um, I guess I'll start on this tonight and, and repacking these into Lowe's boxes. Got a little area to work now. Digging and digging. Doesn't look much different, but it looks. But I've got some area to work in. I've got some place to sort too, as well. So got this whole corner would suck up quite a bit of uh, of this if I can just pack it right. I would have liked to have sorted that whole corner there, because I think because it's possible that some of my stuff's in there, and I want to pull my stuff completely out. This whole side has already been sorted, and none of it's mine. It's all Robert's or my mom's. So, so I guess I'll pull this desk out of here too. I'll use that uh, thing that we're just going to leave in here. Okay, oh I forgot. Yeah, you're right. I went the wrong way. I have to go up and turn around. I don't want to turn around this guy's place. Everybody's robbing him. I want him to get all screwy and shoot it at us. Poor guy. Somebody robbed his bobcat. And who knows? What else? This guy's going crazy. Alright. Robert wants to go get some... Spend some of his money on sundries. the money. He's all shiny though. Not shiny. <laughs> and 
anyway. Well, I'm trying to get him to stop spending on this stuff, but at least my conscience is clear and I'm not the one doing the buying here. Uh, my mom should be in therapy right now. I'm hoping to get back before she's out of it. I don't know what therapy is down there. Probably just walk into the lunchroom <laughs> and back. But at least her hip won't be killing her anymore. Now, now her knees are going to start hurting again. Well, here comes Robert. I was going to wait for the mail, but sometimes it doesn't show up till 2 o'clock, so I'm not going to. I'm going to cruise up to uh, the rehab slash nursing home. Still got a lot to do to get ready for her to come home, so I'll probably leave earlier today. Wow, this guy's like all over the road in this van. He must be stoned or something. He ran over a couple signs back down there in Blairstown. Oh, here I am. Looks like my brother's just getting here from wherever he was. Well, the fire alarm's going off. This is wonderful. Okay, I'm going back home. It's about 7 o'clock at night. It's been a long visit. <laughs> then I got to deal with a dog and everything. Yeah, I gotta go back. I forgot to grab those sandwiches. Leaving for real this time. <clears throat> they only have visiting hours for another 45 minutes anyway. I've been here like all day, so I'm just gonna go home and uh, do some box packing. Deal with a dog. Uh, I don't know what else. I'm not really hungry. I had two ham sandwiches. Nah, that cloud's pretty pretty. I don't even know if this shows up on my film. a few random shots. I caught a rainbow and everything. That was pretty cool. It's actually a lot of beauty in this area. Yeah, this camera doesn't capture a lot of it, I don't think. Anyway, here we come up to Carnot's Crossing. I always remember to look both ways because I think of her, of Carnot. Uh, Remind me not, not to get run over by a train. <laughs> okay, taking a dogger out. And there's your friend, huh? There's your friend over there. She's going out too. Okay, there's Diva.
Mario's girlfriend that he peed on once. Or he tried to. Not the only one. <laughs> <laughs> Other dogs try to pee on her too? Uh, Timmy and Linda's That's not normal. Yeah. <laughs> no boys, but you pee on Okay, I think I'm going to use these spring water things for temporary packing. That should work good. The nice tough boxes. And we are going to be obtaining a lot of them. Well, I got enough cat food for tonight, I believe. Well, my mom was saying that they're not really wanting to give her pain medicine too quickly. And they're elevating her hip in a way where, where it hurts her. Oh, no, Mary, don't, don't bite that toad. They're going to eat the bugs up. Huh, we don't usually have them. The cats really kill them off. Hmm, we don't have too much interest in it. Anyway, um, I packed two boxes so far. I'm not really packing as quickly as I should. I asked my mom if she wanted me to take her out of there. She said, no, not yet. So, let's see what happens. <laughs> 